In this video, let's learn how to do a two sample Z test in Python. I'm using the data from this paper here. We have the variable race here, and we're gonna compare these two groups, white and black people. Because all the observations is under one variable, race, we need to select a subgroup using this code. This code here selects the white people, and this code here selects the black people. Let's see the proportion of college degree broken by black and white. 72% of black people, they have college degree. And for white people, 71%, they have college degree. These numbers are very closer. Your intuition should be, there is no statistical difference between white and black in terms of college degree. Let's write the null hypothesis that the proportion of white people with college degree is the same with the proportion of black people with college degree. We need to get disease statistics and the, we outsource the computation to the computer. From the stats model, let's import the proportion Z test. This code here gives you the number of white people with college degree. And this code here is the number of black people with a college degree. You have to put these two numbers in a NumPy array. Here is the number of observations of white people with college degree. And here is the same but for black people. We store the information in the variable number of observations and we pass this number of observations here. And the, we do the same for count. See that the, to do the proportion Z test, we do not pass the mean, but we pass the necessary information for the computer to calculate the mean. And the result is a Z statistics that is equal minus 0.53. This is not even one standard deviation. And the p-value is 0.6. Therefore, we cannot reject the null hypothesis. If you want to do this computation manually, the p hat is the proportion of white people with a college degree. It's here. And the p hat b is the proportion of black people with a college degree. That's here. And to calculate the standard error, you have to use this formula here. The nw is the number of observations of white people. And the nb is the number of observations of black people. Note that this is the variance of white people and this is the variance of black people. You don't see a covariance factor. That means you are assuming that black and white are independent samples.